Hello everyone, this is Raji. In association with AKST, today let us learn about logical functions. The logical functions are used to evaluate an expression or argument logically and return true or false if the condition is met or not. First, let us see the logic function and. The AND function checks whether both arguments are true. If both arguments are true, then the result will be returned as true, else false. Right click here and add a new column. Here let us see, write the condition if cost price is greater than 150N, selling sale price is greater than 150. If these two conditions are met, then the result will be true. and equal to call the function and select the table cost price write the condition if it is greater than 150 comma sale price is greater than 150 this is the condition let us click enter C if these both conditions are met, we get the result as true, else false. This is about the logic function AND. Now let us check, see the logic function R. So for that create new column, simply right click and select new column. Name it as R equal to call the function R. From the products table. Cost price is greater than 0, 150, comma, today's table, sale price, greater than 0. This R function checks whether one of the arguments is true to written true. If both the arguments are false, then the function returns as false. See here we have all true. Sorry, here I have given 150. Let us see 250. Click enter. See if both the statements are false only, it gives the false. Even if one statement is true, it gives the result as true. This is about our function. Next, let us see under logic function, not. Right click add new column. As rename with this as not. Not equal to not. Call the function. Click enter. So, this changes the false to true or true to false. See, I have taken the logic false. False is turned to true. Not function of this column. You can see the result. Now, let us see under logic function if. Right click and new column. This function checks if a condition is met and returns one value if it is true and another value if it is false. For this, let us take the cost price column. Let us say if the cost price is equal to 80, then, let, uh, then the result should be minimum price. If the cost price is 300 then the result should be maximum price so name it as if equal to call the function if from products table cost price is 
equal to at mm. then let us give the the output should be minimum price else let us give standard price click enter see if the cost price is 18 we get the result as minimum price else we get the standard price as result next logic function is if error this function evaluate an expression and returns a specified value if the expression returns an error otherwise the return value of the expression itself for this let us create a column first let us create a column which has error error let us give it as column only column equal to name it as error call error equal to cost from product table cost price minus at plus Product table sales price. Let us give the function as this. Click enter. See some here we have some error values, infinity values. So now let us see the function if error. So, if error equal to call the function if error from products table select the error column. If error we replace that value with 0. It replaces the error value with 0. See, the error values are replaced with 0. This is all about the logic functions. Thank you.